Intel reaction. Hey, what's going on? It's your boy Sintel with the Intel, and we are getting ready to do another trailer reaction. This time, the second trailer for Uncharted. This should be interesting. I had some kind of feelings regarding the first one and the casting. Hopefully, they're going to show us something a little bit different. But before we get started, make sure you hit that subscription button, click the bell icon so that you can get up to date notifications every time we drop these brand new trailers, just like this one. All right. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get this bad boy rolling. Hey kid, a little young for a bartender, aren't you? A little old for prom, aren't you? <laughs> the more I see it, the more I'm feeling Tom Holland though. The biggest treasure that's never been found. Five billion easy. But it's just a story. I beg to differ. Can you still shake the Spider-Man look from him? It's kind of tough, right? Family found the world's biggest fortune. Antonio Banderas. Yes, man. Bring him back. Keep keep him going. He's still got a lot of trail left on the tires. All in vain. Both you turn your keys clockwise at the same time. <laughs> you almost got me killed. Clockwise, Sully. Well, it was 50-50, so I made a guess. Clearly. All right, so I see that, and I'm not all the way, like, disappointed. I think the chemistry between Tom Holland uh, and, uh, and Sully's character... <laughs> and the character of Sully, uh, it, I think it could work. I mean, because one, one of my, what is it? Um, the Other Guys is a, is a film that uh, Mark Wahlberg has done that I thought was a lot of fun um, regarding like that camaraderie, that buddy cop kind of feel. And I think Tom Holland, he, he's such an endearing and lovable character. It could work for this as well. But the footage was not just about gold. It was something much more valuable. Oh, I got to rewind this. My thing froze. Hold on a second. Rewind this just a touch. Here we go. Just about gold. There's something much more valuable. This girl has a very tragic history. So much blood. I'm pretty sure he's just trying to kill me. I feel a Spider-Man moment. Oh, this is gonna that suck. is why you hire Tom Holland. <laughs> Don't get caught. That works. You were just gonna leave me back there. Somebody had to get the cross. Hey, February 18th is right around the corner. This is gonna be one of the major scenes, or so I thought, until they had another reveal. Mm. Yeah, Your brother that's, that's that pretty, the final it's pretty fun. Well, you know my brother, Sid? You have no idea who you partnered with. What else aren't you telling me? The victor is Boyles. Yeah. How are they going to get them out of here? Look at that. That looks just like the video game. Like, that's a really good shot. This was the part I wasn't expecting. Like, we're gonna take this Pirates of the Caribbean thing and ump it up, app it up a whole other level. Just gonna be cruising with pirate ships in the air. <laughs> yeah, make it epic, man. Yeah. It's gotta feel big. Hey, put them down, boys. <laughs> what is that thing on your face? Yeah, puberty's right around the corner, kids. Exactly in movie theaters. Yo, that's not bad. Okay, listen, it has to feel epic. You got Tom Holland on there, man. I mean, he's he's made one of the largest franchises available in the Spider-Man franchise. I mean, they're already breaking records during a time of COVID. You can't like just half-ass this, and it's looking like Sony's not going to be pulling any punches regarding this. So I was curious as to who was going to play Nathan Drake's uh, brother, but I went to IMDb, and it looks like they've got it uh, pretty much under wraps, which is going to be a really fun uh, reveal because his brother plays a, a relatively pretty large important part <laughs> in the in how the franchise goes down um, how are you feeling about this were you a fan of the game have you ever even never ever heard of the game are you just in it solely because of, of Tom Holland um, how are you feeling about Antonio Banderas yo he still got tread on the tires that's what I'm saying like let's let's squeeze it all out and and I'm feeling him as being a, a, a bit of a villain as well too we don't have to get the suave Antonio Banderas anymore you know he's transitioning into a whole other different type of uh, of typecasting per se so I'm I'm absolutely here for it um so one of the things that I love is you know the in the game uh, Nathan Drake is bouncing from wall to wall swinging on vines you know he's definitely getting his hardcore parkour on 
and you got a guy who's notoriously known for making this happen as Spider-Man. Here's something that there's also interesting too regarding them pushing the boundaries of, of what they could do on screen. Tom Holland has said in an interview where he had felt like this film was a lot more difficult than in the previous Spider-Man films regarding like the physicality of it all and doing all of the stunts. Um, so that should tell you something about how they're trying to go for it. The, the music, the background music, it sounds very, um, you know, Pirates of the Caribbean. Um, you can't help but have the Pirates of the Caribbean feel, right, when you see like the pirate ships floating in the air. But the thing that we loved about the Pirates of the Caribbean franchise is the fact that it was so over the top. So I think this is going to be a hit. I hope it is because then maybe we can change Tom Holland's mind. He has said also in interviews that he's kind of like tired of making movies. He said he's been doing it for like six straight years. He needs to take a break. Think about family, relationships and all of that. But if this bad boy explodes like I think it could, Tom Holland might not be getting that break anytime soon all right well with that being said please make sure you take a break and hit that subscription button click the bell icon so that you get up-to-date notifications anytime new trailers like this drop thank you so much for hanging out yo it's your boy Sintel with intel i'm gonna catch you with the next one peace out